The year 2022 is almost over, and the tech gods have given us some really great phones. Our video of the 10 best smartphones of 2022 has everything you need, whether you're looking for speed, a good camera, or a good deal. The best phone for you depends on what you care most about, like camera quality, battery life, design, specs, price, and more. But before we start our video about top 10 smartphones of 2022, please subscribe to our YouTube channel and press the bell icon as well. Number 10. Xiaomi 12 Pro The Xiaomi 12 Pro has a lot going for it, but it also has two very big problems. It has a sleek, understated design, a beautiful screen with a quad speaker setup, and a chip called Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 that makes it run very well. Most of the time, the camera system is also great. The battery life is a clear flaw, which could be fixed with updates, but is frustrating right now. This is a great phone if you spend most of your time near a charger. Number 9. Vivo X80 Pro Vivo has hit a home run with the X80 Pro, a phone with a camera that can compete with the best from Apple, Samsung, and Google. Four rear lenses are powered by a Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 chip. The main lens is a 50 amp sensor that is very capable. Vivo's V1 Plus image processing chip helps every lens, and the gimbal stabilization on the telephoto lens makes zoom shots clearer. It has a huge number of features, and it takes great photos in low light. Number 8. OnePlus 10 Pro The latest top-of-the-line phone from OnePlus is a good alternative to high-end Android phones like the S22 or Pixel 6 series, especially if you live in the US and don't have many other options. With a Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 and fast 80W wired charging, the 10 Pro has specs that are on par with what its competitors offer. We also like the sleek design, but not everyone does. Even though Hasselblad is involved, the camera is still the phone's biggest flaw and the main thing that makes it different from the more expensive, but otherwise similar Oppo Find X5 Pro. Number 7. Samsung Galaxy Z Flip 4 Samsung fixed the Z Flip 3's bad battery life and average camera quality for the price, making the Z Flip 4 a phone you can use all day with the same main camera and ultra-wide camera as the Galaxy S22 and S22 Plus. It means that this is the best foldable phone you can buy right now, and it costs about the same as flagship phones that don't fold. However, Samsung says that the Flip will last for at least 200,000 opens and closes which is about five years of normal use. The more energy-efficient Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 chipset is likely to blame for the better battery. This means that you no longer have to charge the flip in the middle of the day. Even though 8 gigabytes of RAM is plenty, you might want to spend a little more to get 256 gigabytes of storage. We also love the fingerprint sensor on the side. Number 6. Oppo Find X5 Pro by any measure, the Oppo Find X5 Pro is a great phone. The 6.7 and 10-bit 120Hz QHD Plus panel is one of the best displays on any phone right now. Oppo backs it up with 80 du wired and 50 du wireless charging, a 5000 mAh battery, and a top-tier camera with 50 amp sensors on both the main and ultra-wide lenses. You won't be able to use a periscopic zoom lens because the telephoto lens only zooms by 2x, but the results from all three rear lenses are great. The design is also unique because the camera module is built into the ceramic body of the phone in a way that makes it look like it is one piece. With all of these features and a Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 chip, 256GB of storage, and 12GB of RAM, the Find X5 Pro is also hard to beat in terms of pure performance. Number 5. Google Pixel 6 Pro Google changed things up in 2021. The Pixel 6 and Pixel 6 Pro came out with the company's own Tensor chip and a refreshed version of Android 12 right out of the box. They also had a completely new look and much better cameras. Even though it doesn't have the Pixel XL name, the 6 Pro is still a big phone. It has a beautiful QHD Plus curved edge OLED display that, for the first time in the series, moves to a higher, smoother 120Hz refresh rate. The camera system also uses a new 50 amp main sensor, 
which has an amazing dynamic range and smart new features like Magic Eraser and Rock Solid Face Umbler. It also has a 12MP ultra-wide camera and a Periscope 48MP telephoto camera with a 4x optical zoom. This is a big change from the Pixel Range's old single-sensor way of taking pictures. Number 4. Google Pixel 6a The Pixel 6 and 6 Pro have bigger, better screens and better cameras, but the $449 Pixel phone is a better deal and the one most people should buy. For the price, you get the same Google Tensor chip as the 6 and 6 Pro. This gives you performance on par with flagship phones. Older Pixels in the A-Series were slow, but not this one. You only get a screen with a refresh rate of 60 Hz, a slow 18W charger, and a plastic back that is easy to scratch. The main camera is only 12.2 MP, the same as on the Pixel 5, instead of the 50 MP camera on the Pixel 6. But other than that, it's a great deal for something that's almost as good as a Pixel, with 3 years of Android OS updates and 5 years of security updates. Number 3 iPhone 13. Even though it doesn't have the 13 Pro's high refresh rate display, the iPhone 13 still has cutting-edge features like Apple's newest 5 NIM, a 15 Bionic chip, and the latest camera features like cinematic mode. The rear camera system now sits at an angle, mostly to make room for the impressive sensor shift OIS that was only available on the iPhone 12 Pro Max in 2020. On the front, you still get a beautiful 6.1-inch OLED display with a smaller notch, even though the refresh rate is still 60 Hz. iOS 15 is a great improvement on Apple's already well-respected mobile operating system. It adds features that make sure you're not constantly distracted by your device, like the notification summary. Number 2. Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra The S21 Ultra had some note-like features, but the S22 Ultra is definitely a full-fledged successor to the Note 20 Ultra, except for its name. The design is very different from the other Galaxy S22 phones, and it comes with a S Pen stylus that makes it more useful than most of its competitors, especially in terms of productivity. Even though the camera hardware looks familiar, Samsung has made improvements that make it one of the best camera systems in any phone right now. It has a 108 MP main shooter that is supported by an ultra wide and two telephoto lenses with different zoom levels. Number 1. The iPhone 13 Pro. In 2020, the regular iPhone 12 beat out its pro branded sibling, but in 2021, the iPhone 13 Pro is the phone to beat. At first glance, the 13 Pro has a familiar 6.1 inch Super Retina XDR display. However, Apple has finally added promotion to the iPhone, so the panel can now go as fast as 120 Hz, which is very smooth. Also, the notch is 20% smaller. As for the cameras, you can expect bigger sensors and faster apertures, which mean better low-light performance, much better quality when switching to the phone's ultra-wide camera, and a 3x telephoto snapper that lets you shoot further than before. Also, when it comes to video capture, the iPhone is still the best. It has gotten some smart new features, like cinematography mode, which give you more control over how your footage looks in real time. So these are the top 10 smartphones of 2022. If you like the video, leave a comment and subscribe to our channel for more top 10 videos. Press the bell icon for latest updates. Thanks for watching.